Uh, former Fairfax County Public Schools contractors behind bars and we do want to warn you that some of the details can be disturbing. Yeah, for sure. Now police say he filmed children on school grounds there without their permission and he also possessed child pornography. Now today, police in Fairfax County public school leaders announcing new charges against 25 year old Arturo Elmore Aiden. Our Randy Bass joining us live now with the latest on this. Yes, police chief Kevin Davis called Arturo Ar Elmore Adon a disturbing and sick man, saying he now faces 24 felony charges just 25 days into their investigation here in Fairfax County. Some of those charges stemming from upskirt photos he allegedly took of a little girl here at Churchill Road Elementary School in McLean. Police executed search warrants on his phone after he was arrested after allegedly touching a little girl and taking a photo of her shorts at a Reston grocery store earlier this month on his phone. Police say they found 400 images of child sexual abuse material downloaded from international websites, along with seven videos he allegedly took himself, both here at Churchill Road Elementary School and Fox Mill Elementary School in Reston. Police say his victims were little girls between the ages of six and eight years old. What our detectives discovered inside El More Adon's phone was nothing short of disturbing and disgusting. These seven videos were surreptitiously filmed by either hiding that, his phone in a bathroom or by placing his phone underneath the dresses, skirts, and shorts of the young children. Detectives are still combing through over a half of a terabyte of digital content. Again, the 25 year old man arrested in this case worked here alongside other workers with an after school program that still does business with Fairfax County Public Schools. More on that coming up at five o'clock. Police say they are concerned there are additional victims. Anybody who's had any contact with him at all is urged to get in contact with detectives. In McLean, I'm Randy Bass, DC News Now.